Hello everyone and welcome to uh, not a let's play this time, but a walkthrough of all Eve endings. Uh, this video will show you all the different kind of endings and it will, I will also show you how to get them. And we will start with the from the bad, the worst endings to the best endings to the last. And I will show you on the way how to get the corresponding ending, blah 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 blah. Let's get it on. Okay, so to get the worst ending, you have to start in here, in this room where the mirror is. And uh, this mannequin head will show up. Blah blah blah. Then check the mirror again, and it will pop up. Eek! He goes. And Gary will start kicking it. Instead of stopping Gary, you have to cover your eyes. That will make Gary kick the mannequin head. And the mannequin hit us on the floor. This was also result in these two popping up. So on to the next step of getting a first ending. So in this room, you have to pull the string that's most to the right, this one. And it will make a mannequin head fall down and just scare him a lot again. It will also make more mannequin heads appear. So that's uh, another trigger to get the worst endings. So in the brown room, you go down here, and you see these three mannequin heads. So go ahead, grab the key, tip over this mannequin head. Oh, don't leave it. Oh, what am I doing? Um, tip it over, take it off, and that's it. What you would normally do, but if you want to get the worst endings, you have to tip all three of them, or just one of them would be enough. But just tip three of them, just to be sure. You will hurt yourself in the process, but yeah. Oh, no, don't do that. Take it off. Yes, I am sure. Take it off. Bam! This will also make more mannequin heads appear in uh, other rooms, which is kind of scary because this one's crying blood. So on to the next point. Uh, the next take on. So the next part in this violet area, where this doll wants to take uh, it with you. So instead of moving it carefully, you have to kick it into the wall. And it will splatter. You kind of murdered it. It will be sad. And it says it hurts, it hurts. And it will appear again up here, just the head. There's no body, and we'll say it's all your fault. My head was plucked off. So on to the next part. Kind of scary. Oh, uh, and this in the sketchbook, you will see a hanged Eep. Eep is hanging upside down. Apparently, Gary can't see it. Uh, so it's only Eep can see. It's kind of spooky that that she's hanging upside down there. Also, when you fall down. While trying to get the bad ending, worst endings or whatever, when you fall down in the toy box, you will not be able to find your red rose. It's just simply impossible because it's not there. And you will see why. We will find Gary. Oh, I hit my head very hard. Wee oui, wee oui, wee. Oui. What's that, Gary? You're French? <laughs> oh, anyway, talk to Gary, whatever. Just say whatever. Doesn't mean it matter what you tell him. Blah, blah, blah. We have to get out. You lost your rose. That's not good. Doesn't matter. I can't find your rose, and the key will be here, not camouflaged or anything. You won't be able to find your rose because the doll took it, and she's get and uh, well, it's giving it to Mary. Uh, I don't want to spoil much. What to do here? Uh, you have to figure out. But the, the choice you're giving, I don't think it really matters. Or maybe it does. I don't know. Yes, you want the flower back because you can't live without it. So you want the rose back. But to be able to get the rose back, uh, Mary proposed a trade. Stare. I don't know. I just stare. Okay, it doesn't really matter what choice you make. He, he will exchange the rose, so it doesn't matter what choice. 
This is where Mary starts to pluck off of, uh, Gary's rose, and Gary will collapse. Uh, yeah. This is where Mary just destroys the rose. And off she goes. Okay, from this point here, you can get two different endings. So you have the choice to chase after Mary or go back to Gary. So we'll go with the... Uh, well, let's see. Let's go after Mary. And we'll be guessing she ran down here. Because we got the pink key. Oh yeah, we left Gary behind because he couldn't walk anymore. Because, yeah, Mary uh, destroyed her, his rose. So we gotta go down here. That's right here. BAM! You don't know one of the words. <laughs> Woo! So you got the choices. But uh, if you step away, you will get... The chance of going back to your real world will... Uh, be closed, so... And you'll get the ending, Eep All Alone. There are three kinds of uh, Eep All Alone. There's one with the fake Gary, and there's one with the fake mother. I will show you that also. But the ending's just the same, Eep All Alone. So if you go with the choice of leap... So if you go with the choice of leap into the painting, Eep will jump in. And she jumped in and goes back to the real world. And you will see Mary, who will follow Eep. You come back out in the real world, and you don't remember what you did. So you go, leave this room. If you try to go back, you skip it. That room never existed. Uh, Hank, man, so? To, you just go back to the reception, and you will see your parents and Mary. And apparently, Mary is your sister here. So apparently, when Mary comes after you, she becomes your sister. Everyone's memory just have some... Your parents' memory and your own memory becomes that Mary exists in this real world. And she is your sister, apparently. And you give her your candy that you got from Mary. So, I don't know if this is a bad ending, because you look even... I mean, Mary's not really that bad when you think about it. All she wanted was to go out uh, of the painting, but she needed one to stay behind, which Gary was. I don't know if that's bad if you want Gary or Mary, but look how happy they are. It's kind of... But then again, you leave Gary behind. Sad ending, with a uh, happy ending, with sacrifices. Well, she's a crazy bitch when you get to her room. But that's the together forever ending. Okay, from this part, when you don't you don't follow Mary, but you want to enter Mary's room, but these thorns are in the way, and Gary's not with you, and you got uh, you gotta go back and get where Gary collapsed and get his lighter. Gary is dead, but Eve will maybe he looks dead. But Eve sees Gary sleeping, so we have to take the lighter. But you have too, too many things, so you can't pick it up. So you eat your candy. Om nom 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 nom. Now you got space. Then you just take the lighter. Well, borrow the lighter, but you'll never get it back. So Gary's dead. You get back up here. Burn the thorns! Burn it! Burn the crayon painting. So you enter Mary's room. And okay, and obviously Mary will come after you. Because this is her room actually her life how did you get into this room 
Oh, she's mad now. She's a crazy bitch. She will kill you. This is why you run and burn the painting. Just burn the painting. The other two won't do anything. So you burn Mary, which is sad. Oh no! Die! Mary burns up. And you see all this shit. And read the book here. Where Mary writes that she likes visitors, but she really wants to go out. And the only way she can get out is Ramon will take her place, which will be Gary. So back here, we go back here after burning Mary's picture. You will again have two options with this picture. You can step away, which will result that you all alone again. But there we don't. We already saw that, so we don't want to see that again. So leave me into the painting. Then someone will call out for you, and guess who it is? It's Gary. But it's not the real Gary, it's the fake Gary. Because if you go with Gary... Go with Gary... The fake Gary though. Eep all alone, because the fake Gary... Even though he says there's another exit, he's lying, because there's no other exit. So you shouldn't have gone with Gary. So, back to the other choices. So instead of going with Gary, you just say straight out no. And he will still insist that we can go out the other way. He try to catch you, but you escape. And once again, once you get into the real world again, you don't remember anything. What were you doing? And the room disappears again. That, were, that room never existed. So to continue to get the ending, you will see a painting of Gary, dead. Forgotten portrait. A sleeping man. Sleeping man, but he's probably obviously dead. And your mother appears to come and get you. Stop up, look back, and you just run away. And that's the ending. The forgotten portrait with forgotten Gary. Gary that's left behind. Dead. Forgotten portrait ending. That was the worst endings. So let's try to get the good ones, shall we? Oh yeah, while I'm speedrunning, you can see the picture of Eep here, if you're doing the hardest seek. You see a painting of uh, hanged Eep here. Okay, first thing you have to do is to, uh, to get the, the good endings is to bond with Gary. Yes, you have to bond with Gary, get his friendship. And the first thing you have to do is read about this. You have to read this, because it will bond with Gary. Because, ah no, now I'm stuck. That was pretty stupid of me. Again. Next step is here in the mirror room, again. Hey, the mannequin head. Here you have to stop Gary. Don't cover your eyes. Stop Gary. It was also bond. Your relationship with Harry. The next part of bonding here when you wake up from your nightmare is to pick up Gary's coat. And I'll do a save quickly here. You hand over the coat and you speak to Gary seven or more times until he start saying until he stops saying something new. So just keep talking to him. I hope you can read as fast as I do. <laughs> so 
Just keep talking to him more than seven times, just to be sure that you talked with him enough. G. <laughs> Freak out, Gary. Okay, I don't know how many times I talked with him, but I think it is enough. Okay, the next part to bond with Gary is you have to get through this rope maze here. Which is pretty easy to solve actually. Uh, as I've been through this already, so... Press this blue button. Press it. And voila! Your escape. Read this. I don't know if that's actually important. But yeah, you bond with Gary by going through the rope maze. And... Milk puzzle. It doesn't matter which one you answer. You bond with him either way. That's also one of those things you have to do. Also at this part here, where the lights goes off. Gary asks you if you're there, so either answer I'm here or I'm not. It doesn't matter. One of these two. Just say I'm here, because you actually are. I don't know if it does it when I'm trying to get the good ending. Oh yeah, it still does it. So if you look at the mirror, you will see all these kind of creepy things. So someone gouged our eyes out in this mirror. And back to normal. And back to normal. Back to normal. Play? No! The, g <laughs> the mirror is asking me to continue playing, but if you... Okay, when you get to this part, where you, where you have to move the doll, don't kick it, just move it. Move it carefully. Don't want to get mad at you. Ah, uh, here's something I didn't show in my video. Can you see that ear there? It's hearing that... And then you hear some text here. I heard Mary's... Secret! I didn't show this before, because I didn't realize it. Me. So yeah, inside the sketchbook, where you find Gary again... You either answer him, I'm fine, or I'm hurt all over. It doesn't matter which one, it all adds up to your bond level. This one doesn't, so just say I'm fine. Well, you got one rose left. So you add, so you burnt Mary's picture with Gary, and you're here. Uh, with this big painting again, which always seems to be the big end. Look at that! Finally! Then someone calls out to you, and who could that be? It's Eve's mom! A fake mom! And she wants you to go with her! And Gary keeps yelling at Eve. Uh, apparently, Gary can't see Eve's mother. So, if we happen to go with Mary, we will get another uh, Eve all alone, as you've seen in my playthrough. So, I'll just have I just included here again. Go with mother. And there, mother goes. She was a fake, and it continues along. And we get the ending. Eep all alone, so there's different versions of it. A version where you step back, a fake Gary, and a fake mother. And here we are again, back! And instead of going with mother, grab Gary's hand. And first time I got this, I got this at this point on my playthrough, on my let's play, when I grabbed Gary's hand, I got a game over screen, so I had a glitch bug or something so let's go with oh I didn't get a game over screen this time so we're out in the real world again and Maria has no memories of what she was doing we're back in the real world and you don't see that big painting anymore they hanged a man Oh yeah, what do you do now? Okay, just go find your parents, I guess. 
Because I actually haven't played through this part yet, so I don't know. Oh, there he is. Talk to Gary. Hmm? Gary doesn't remember anything either. And we get the ending. Memories crannies. There is one more ending and that's where Gary remembers you. But how do we get that? I will show you, just in a sec. Okay, to... At, when you're at this part, you have to talk to Gary several times, like six times or so, to raise bond relationship. I haven't done this before, so... Uh, just keep talking to him. Three... Pellet knife. Okay, that should be enough. You just have to talk to Gary six or more times at this spot to raise bond level or relationship. Cause when you do that, when you burn Mary's pictures, you will see an option that you will see in just a sec. Mary burns up. That's what you get. Trying to kill us with a pellet knife. So we got at this point. And Gary will notice his hand. He cut it. And this is where you give him the handkerchief, because it will be needed for the good ending. You give him the handkerchief. BAM! Take it, you bitch! Okay, take it, Gary. So, you choose that option to get uh, a better ending. So we're back at this part! I mean, so we're back at this part after giving Gary the handkerchief. So, grab Gary's hand. Because we don't want to go with the fake mother again. And you're out here again with no memories what so happened. So go and find Gary. We should be. On the ground floor. He should be here. There he is. You talk to him. And then you talk to him. Wait, what? Who's he? How do you remember? How odd. But actually... <gasps> oh, he got a flashback! I actually never seen this ending. I played through following uh, guidelines. Oh, oh, it was Eep, you bitch. <laughs> Obviously, I remember, I'm the player. Oh, a 
promise to see each other again. Eve. Oh, we get a true ending here? I guess this is the true ending. Oh, we get a uh, full credits here. That's uh, cool, I guess. So we got this is the f true ending. Uh, how do I skip all this? Cause we just want to see the ending title, not the BGM and sound effects and so on. I guess I have to edit it out. Oh, unless you want to see all of this. Oh, this is where Gary lost his flower. He got butt raped! Wait, it doesn't explain much. The painting ladies are not able to open doors. How was she in that room? Oh, here's Mary. I guess you want to see all this, cause... Yeah. Screenshots and all. Oh, nice picture. Promise of reunion. Oh, Eve is pretty cute when she smiles. So that's the ending, the true ending. Promise of reunion. Uh, hope you all enjoyed all of this. Watching all of my uh, walkthrough of getting all these kind of different endings. <sighs> and what, man? If I missed anything, you you can tell me. But yeah, I got all the endings and I showed you how to get them. I don't know what more to say here. <laughs> hope you enjoyed watching my playthrough and I hope you enjoyed this video of getting all the endings. So, exit. Bye. What should we do? Oh! You punch Gary in the face! <laughs> Let's punch him once more time. He punch! Oh, you like that, Gary? Huh? You like getting punched in the face? Oh? Oh, what are you doing, Eep? Oh, okay. <laughs>